look like real hard cases, Bob. Did you kill all seven of them dead? Or did you just wing some of them? Now, that is you there, Henry Bob, on the cover. The Duck of Death. Oh, it's the Duke. Duke, Duke of Death. Duke, oh, yeah. You always were a hell and Jesus with a pistol, Bob. But seven of them, boy. And you protect that woman and all that. How, how the hell do you do that? Uh, let me see. Uh, it's generally considered desirable in the publishing business to take a certain liberty when you're depicting the uh, the cover scene. It is for reasons involving the marketplace, etc. Et well, Mr. Beauchamp, from what I read this here book, the writing is not that much different than the picture. Well, I can assure you, Mr. Daggett, that the events that are described in there are taken from the account of eyewitnesses, sir. Eyewitnesses? Yes, sir. You mean like the duck himself, I guess? <laughs> they, the Duke. Duck, I says. You have insulted the honor of this beautiful woman, Corcoran, said the duck. You must apologize. But Two-Gun Corcoran would have none of it. In cursing, he reached for his pistols and would have killed him. But the duck was faster. And hot a lad blazed from his smoking six guns. See, I consider that to be an accurate depiction of the events. I'll be all right. There is a certain poetry to the language which I couldn't resist. Uh, Mr. Beauchamp, I was in the Blue Bottle Saloon in Wichita the night that English Bob killed Corky Corcoran. And I didn't see you there. No, no woman. No two gun shooters. They're none of this. You were there? Yeah, I was there. First off, Corky never carried two guns. Oh, he should have. No, he, he was he was called two gun Corcoran. Yeah, well, a lot of folks did call him two gun. But that wasn't because he was sporting two pistols. That was because he had a dick that was so big, it was longer than the barrel on that Walker Colt that he carried. And the only insulting he ever did was stick that thing of his into this French lady that English Bob here was kind of sweet on. You see, the night that Corky walked into the Blue Bottom, and before he knows what's happening, Bob here takes a shot at him, and he misses because he's damn drunk. Now, that bullet wasn't by panicked old Corky, and he did the wrong thing. He went for his gun in such a hurry, he shot his own damn toe off. Meantime, Bob here, he's aiming real good, and he squeezes off another. But he misses, because he's still so damn drunk, and he hits this $1,000 mirror up over the bar. But now, the duck of death is as good as dead, because Corky does it right. He aims real careful. No hurry. And bam! That Walker Colt blew up in his hand which was a failing common to that model. You see, if old Corky had to have two guns and instead of just a big dick, he would have been there right to the end to defend himself. Wait a minute, you mean... You mean that English, English Bob killed him when he didn't even have... Well, old Bob wasn't going to wait for Corky to grow a new hand. No, he just walked over there real slow. Because he was drunk. Shot him right through the liver. 